Oh, it just worked. Oh, no. Oh, what's about to happen here? We're going to go to outer space and... <laughs> YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Wobbly Life, and yes, folks, we are back once again, and today I am finally tired of it. I'm tired of OB outdoing me, and if you're wondering what I'm talking about, it's the whole fact that he has a mansion, and I don't. Like, how did that even happen? Like, I'm better than OB, that's the way it's supposed to be. I know this sounds terrible, but yeah. He's got a mansion, I've got a cruddy old farmhouse, and today, that's gonna change because I've been grinding away, playing all the jobs, and I'm tired. I don't want to do it anymore. I mean, we're gonna do it one more time, but we're gonna buy the mansion today, and we're gonna buy maybe a sports car or something, so we can rub it in Obi's ugly face. I sound terrible. By the way, I don't mean when I, I say bad things to him, but I kind of do mean it, but... You guys know what I mean. So if you guys are excited for me to go by the mansion, maybe hit that thumbs up button and helps out my channel and let's do this. All right, here we go. It is time to sell this house. Say goodbye to the house and boom. Oh yeah, $2,400. You know what? That's not good enough though. We're gonna get in our old crappy car here and we're gonna go run one more job. That way we can for sure buy a nice car to go with our brand new mansion. And uh, we're going to show it off. We're going to do like an episode of Cribs or something because it's going to be amazing. So let's go. You know what? Something we haven't done in a while. Let's go deliver some pizzas because I'm kind of hungry right now while we're recording. And I want a pizza. Now you're probably going to say, Komodo, you have a burger as an icon. Why aren't you going to go do that? Well, we did the burger job the other day and I don't want to do it. I want to go deliver pizzas. So yeah, that's what we're doing. By the way, I like how I turned the whole first of the episode into a rant about OB. <laughs> Oh boy. All right. So pizza place is right over here. Uh, we've already done the uh, the pizza mission where you spawn in the aliens. So I don't think there's really much to do here besides just do a plain old delivery. We're not going to get any surprises, I don't think. All right. I'm ready to uh, deliver. Let's go and accept the job. We're working for Wobbly Pizza. By the way, where's the pizza? Okay. We got two of these. Mm -hmm. Grab this one and hey, grab, grab this one. Hey, hey, get it. Okay, there it goes. Oh, no, totally got it. Okay, I got it. All right, let's go take these pizzas because, you know what? We're done with this job. We don't need this kind of work anymore. We've got the mansion coming. Okay, throw these in there. Okay, here we go. By the way, is there more than one mansion we can buy or is it just the one? I'm not really sure. We're going to go scouting out that neighborhood here in a second. Oh, dear. Okay, come on. No, okay, we're going to fill the pizza mission. I feel like a failure. Okay, where is this drop off at? Oh, we're dropping it off to the police. All right, here we go. And, uh, okay, come on, get him out, get him out. Oh, I might not make this. This might be like, uh, might be the first time I fail like a job. Okay, here we go. I got your pizzas. Oh, I think we might make it. I love this jetpack. All right, here we go. Uh, here's your pizza. Yeah, buddy, 40 bucks. I can't tell you how many of these pizzas I've had to deliver in order to get this. Like I did the pizza job some, I did uh, the burger job once or twice. I was trying to figure out what made the most money and yeah, they're all kind of hard. Uh, the post delivery job, that one was actually pretty good. Like I, I banked pretty good off that one. And I tried to find some more presents, which unfortunately I found like, I don't want to say all of them, but I found a ton of them and they're so hard to find now. But that free money is not a thing anymore. By the way, here, throw this in the bank. All right, so you see my money. Let's go over to the neighborhood and buy a house. Okay, so looking up here, you know, it really, really stinks that this is the thing Obi's gonna hold over my head is the whole fact that he got the mansion first. There's the mansion. What are these out here? Okay, those are the neighborhood houses. Is there another mansion? Is there like a snow top mansion somewhere that I can buy? There's a house up here, but it's not a mansion. I think we pretty much have to buy the same mansion he's got. But yeah, that doesn't make me very happy but you know it's fine it's bad i sound like such a grumpy old person right now all right here we go mansion time and then card time this is mine you know it'd be bad if they jacked up the prices on this once again all right here we go uh 1500 and boom we have a mansion and we still have 940 dollars left over check this out all right we got plenty of room for a monster truck and we're gonna go buy another vehicle Oh, let's go in here. Oh, yes. 
Smell that. It smells so fresh and new. Uh, what else is in here? You know, we've gone in here and, like, robbed Obi's house. Oh, there's a nice little YouTuber set up in here. But, yeah, I've never actually taken the time to, like, look around. By the way, we have a shower. This is a, a new feature in Wobbly Life. Like, I don't really understand it, but you can take showers now. Uh, okay. You know what? I need to go get my, uh, my hat back on. I gotta rep that Komodo Gaming merch real quick. Boom! There we go. Alright, Komodo Gaming merch is back on. Alright, so let's go over here real quick. Let's grab our monster truck out, and we want to just park it in the garage. Oh, it barely fits in the garage. You know, this is a very common problem we have in Texas with our trucks. Like, half of them don't fit. Like, I swear, I own a truck, and I can use one side of my garage because it's slightly deeper than the other side, and I almost hit my garage door every time I pull in. So, I kind of don't use the garage half the time. Okay, so hear me out. We need to go buy a fancy suit now since we're a uh, fancy living, and we need to buy a fancy car. So I feel like, wouldn't that put me a step above, OB, as far as my fanciness? Like, I feel like it would. All right, let's head down to the car dealership and buy ourselves a new set of wheels. All right, here we are at the car dealership. I want your most fancy, expensive car that is in the rocket car or the old uh, monster truck. By the way, can we ride this? Come on, grab onto this. I can't grab onto the wacky, waving, inflatable, arm flailing two man. I'm kind of disappointed that's not a feature. All right, cars for sale. I want your fanciest car. Here, let me have something. Uh, no, 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 no. Wait, what's this? Wait, is this a flatbed? Uh, nah, no. <gasps> Ooh, why have I? Oh yeah, you only see these on the island. I had to think about it for a second. I was like, where do those come from? Okay, a forklift. And I own that. You gotta be kidding me. They don't have a sports car in here? Like, what do I buy to outdo OB? I mean, he probably doesn't have a forklift that he owns. You know what? Boom. Fancy living right there. Forklift. All right, where's my forklift? Oh, I guess I have to go get it round back or something. Yeah, there's probably somebody slapping themselves in the face right now saying, Komodo, that's not a very fancy car, but, I mean, does OB own one of these? That's what we have to ask ourselves now. So we've got rocket car, we've got uh, the monster truck, and we've got our new forklift. Also, uh, I mean, do any of his cars do this? Ha <laughs> ha! Got him! Alright, let's head down to the clothes store. Up, 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 up! Okay, we just dropped that. This is fine. Also, we can go to the dye store and maybe customize some of our clothes. Wait, can we customize the headpieces? Can we, like, change the Komodo burger? Maybe make it a nasty patty or something? What am I on? By the way, this thing can barely get. <laughs> this thing cannot get over a curb. <laughs> Okay, so maybe the, the forklift isn't the greatest car, but it's mine, and I own it, and that's all that matters. All right, here we are at the dye shop. Can I uh, paint my face? Is that is that a thing? Interact. Oh, the top. Okay, the hat. We can customize. Oh, I can make my patty green. I mean, I don't know who wants a green patty, but uh, we're going to do this. This is cool. All right, so we got a green patty. Let's make sure it's really nice and bright. Uh, let's go ahead and customize this. The rest of this into, like, Komodo gaming gear. So we're gonna be, like, red down here. Uh, and then maybe we'll go on the bottom. We'll go with the, uh, maybe the black. There we go. Dude, we looking kind of funky. I like this. All right, let's go. You know, this really defeats the purpose of what we were about to do. We're gonna go to the clothes store and maybe try to find a tuxedo if they have it to complete my fanciness. We can always go back to the dye store and, and paint it, but I don't think we'll have to. Uh, oh, by the way, where's the clothes at? I always get lost in the city somehow. All right, let's pull in. I guess the next things to do besides the new updates, we really need to start padding our bank account because there's actual achievements for that. Uh, all right, let's go in here. Okay, so I need something fancy. Do we have a suit of some sorts? If not, we need to get a suit. Huh? I need to find a better bottom real quick because this bottom's a little distracting. We have something uh, that kind of looks nice. Okay, so if we can find some sort of suit, we would be fine. Uh, okay, there we go. I'm liking this. Hold on. Do we have just some actual, like, nice pants? Like, those look decent back here. I mean, I guess this would go together. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, that totally fits me. Okay, I don't think I have an option but to go with the suit here. So there we go. Fancy living right there. We now have a tuxedo, we have a forklift, and we have a mansion. Like, I feel like we've won. I don't even have to play anymore. Like, I could just end the video right here. 
if we just say we won. All right, folks, I'd like to welcome you to my fancy new house and my fancy new whip, the, uh, the forklift. Uh, I was going to actually spawn in all the other vehicles, but apparently you can't have all your personal vehicles out at once. Like, I wanted to stick the monster truck out here and have the rocket car, but it's fine. You know, I think I've come to some sort of dilemma. Like, what do I feel? Like, do I feel satisfied that I just bought all this useless crap and that I don't think I really feel any better about myself? I mean, this is kind of like a moral story I'm trying to explain to you guys here. But yeah, I mean, we got a mansion, but I still feel empty on the inside. So, uh, when we feel empty on the inside, uh, we don't have much of an option but to go do something. Something else. And I don't even know what we're going to do, so let's go find something. Okay, so I have a bit of an idea here. So, everybody's been commenting on my videos saying, Hey, you can glitch in and get eaten by the monster. Which, by the way, you don't actually get eaten by the monster uh, in the pit down here. But, somebody else mentioned something uh, that I don't think I've ever tried before. So if we go down to this pit, we're not going to feed the monster, which by the way, I don't even think the monster's in there right now. I think it's only in there during the job, the radioactive job. But somebody was saying this thing here is actually kind of dangerous. So you look at this thing here and you think, okay, well, it's just like a conveyor belt. Well, apparently this is like the conveyor belt of death. So here we go. Uh, oh, this thing's getting kind of fast. I don't think I want to ride this. Uh, I don't have any option. I got to please the viewers. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and... Oh, that was a fail. Okay, three, two, one, and we, oh, jeez. Oh, okay. That actually launched me a lot further than I thought it would. What if I were to like, I don't know, hold on to something else while trying that. So I got an idea. What if I were to do this with a bomb? On, do these go off? Oh, okay. Oh, no, don't over there. Okay, How, what's the timer like on those? Okay, oh, wait, what? How did they blow up the other ones? Okay, here we go. Okay, get the bomb. Wait for it. Wait for it. Okay, we're going to let it actually start up, and then we're going to try to launch ourselves with the bomb. Uh, maybe we'll go to space here. We're reaching, folks. All right, here we go. All right, got it. And no, oh, okay, that didn't work at all. <laughs> oh, dear. What am I doing with my life? Okay, I got one more idea. What if we go get the bouncy thing and we bounce our way into there? Like, that might be kind of funny. Okay, so we're going to see if we can go super high here. What happens if we jump off this? Do we, like, bounce, like, really, really high? Oh, we kind of do. You know what I almost want to attempt? Like, I kind of want to drop one of these from a hot air balloon. If I can get it up in it. I don't know if I can get it up in the balloon itself. But I feel like you would go, like, super high. All right, let's turn this back on. There we go. Okay, we are good to go. All right, let it get up to full speed. What do you guys think's about to happen here? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Uh, oh. What the? This is what happens when you break the physics in the game. This, this doesn't work. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> I just launched myself into a tree. Oh, don't lose the vehicle. I need the vehicle. Oh, no. Okay, it's still over there. Okay, so somehow that doesn't work. But certainly you get more air the higher you get so you could send this off a hot air balloon it's just a matter of can you get it in a hot air balloon like you really can't pick this vehicle up i mean you could use the genius vehicle that i i bought and we could use the uh the the old uh forklift there okay i could totally bounce up in this yeah i've got the momentum here uh we're gonna see what happens here i, I hope this works Okay, almost there. So we got to time this right. I want to bounce into the basket here. Okay, bounce into the basket. Bounce into the basket. Wait. Ooh. <gasps> oh, oh, no, 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 don't, don't stop. Wait, what just happened? How do we end up in this? Uh, no, no, no. Wait, does this work? Are we good? <gasps> okay, jump out. <gasps> we got it in. Holy man, this is going to work. This is a grand finale here. You guys just thought I was wasting time in Wobbly Life. Well, we're actually going to waste some time by dropping this thing from the sky. All right, folks, we're ready for the drop here. Okay, get in. Okay. Oh, oh, it just worked. Oh, no. Oh, what's about to happen here? We're going to go to outer space and... <laughs> Wait, we just went higher than the hot air balloon. What the heck? Hold on. Are we going to get even more height here? And... <laughs> okay, you don't get as high the second time, but that was funny. Hold on, let's start going across the city real quick. And... <laughs> okay. 
Well, this was totally worth it. You know, I didn't think this was going to work. And we... So what we learn here today? We learned that doing stupid stuff and wobbly sometimes has stupid, unexpected results. Kind of like what we just did here. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time.